Perhaps whatever lies ahead is what he wants us to see. Let's keep going. Condition. a little closer. Hit. Most 
Ability to compel. Quietly now. Here comes the catch. You're in for a little shot. As a good night should. Busted. Spark things up a little. Quiet <laughs> 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 now. Leave it all to me. <laughs> Come a little cl Urine for a little. Come a little closer. Urine for a little shock. I must leave no stone unturned. Churl camp. Oh, these hilly churls look like they're in pretty bad shape, too. Some of them look like they've already taken their final breath. Is this what Haftan wanted to show us? Whether it is or not, everything here is worth investigating in detail. Inspect the area. Leave no stone unturned. Before long, they'll become one with the darkness. 
The hilly trails we meet in the wild are always so rowdy. Paimon never would have imagined that this is how they spend their final days. We may not have a whole lot of happy memories dealing with hilly churls, but still, Paimon hopes they're at peace in their last moments. Hilly churls usually store food in crates like these, right? But they seem pretty much empty. Is it because they're so near to the end that they don't need to eat anymore? Even if they don't need to eat anymore, Paimon bets they still miss food for the flavor. <laughs> There's even a bonfire here! Like what Hilly Churls built in the wild! Wait! But wasn't Dane saying that hilly churls get scared of the light when they reach the very end of their lives? Hmm. Maybe, in the very, very end, they still want to feel some light and warmth. Oh. Uh, just thinking aloud here uh, could also be another reason. <laughs> How did that flower get this far underground? Did someone bring it in memory of the deceased hilly churls? Hey, now that you mention it, Paimon thinks it looks kind of familiar too! It is the national flower of Kanria, the Intivat. It once bloomed all over the nation. It would only last two weeks before wilting. But if you were to pluck one and take it out of Kanria, the petals would stop growing and turn hard. Only when it finally returned to its home soil would the petals grow soft once more and finally turn to dust. So the Intivat is a symbol for a wanderer far from home, signifying the tenderness of the homeland. <gasps> so for this flower to get here, it must have been brought from... Your Highness, so the proposal finally has your blessing? In focusing single-mindedly on confronting the heavenly principles, we neglected our original mission, the revival of the homeland. I should not have been so indecisive. The device is almost ready. We await your command. What are the chances of succeeding? Theoretically speaking, uh, approximately... Forget it. Even a 1% chance is enough. For too long have we dwelt in the Abyss. Surely they would rather return to the natural cycle of life and death as soon as possible than continue to exist as they are, without a shred of dignity. They cannot be made to continue paying the price for those so-called sins. The Order is most fortunate to be graced with your decision. Ether! You saw something, didn't you? Can you tell me what it was? Yeah. You zoned out for quite a while there. Huh. Well, people do say that twins have a special connection. It sounds as if they are attempting to make use of certain equipment to cleanse the curse. It could well be the device we saw earlier. And you say he mentioned the revival of the homeland, correct? No surprise there. Stubborn as ever. It appears as if the Abyss Order plans to use this location to cleanse the Hilly Churls of their curse and restore them to the way they once were. 
Then, they will serve as the foundation for reviving the nation of Kanria. After all, there can be no nation without a people. <laughs> it is the height of foolishness. They have no chance of success, not even a 1% chance. I told you already that no one knows this curse better than I, having lived with it for 500 years. There is no redemption. There is no undoing the curse. Trying to remove it by force will achieve nothing but to inflict further suffering. So make sure you are clear in your mind. You have to tell yourself, they are no longer human. If you cling to false hope and allow yourself to become too emotionally invested, the only way is down. You will end up just like them, mired in hypocrisy. Save your strength for something worth saving. Oh? <laughs> but of course, I am merely someone you hired for a task, while he, it is only natural for you to side with him. But whatever decision you make cannot deter me from mine. My chosen path is to stop the abyss. If we have reached an impasse, then perhaps this is where we should say... I see. It seems that the three questions I put to you on our first meeting were worthwhile. You have developed your own individual views on this world. Very well. Since you have volunteered your true thoughts on this matter, I shall not hide mine from you. Right now, I have a more immediate agenda than stopping the Abyss. That is to say, the Abyss's actions here directly dishonor the final wishes of Halfdan and my other compatriots. I cannot allow this to proceed. The Abyss may appear at any moment. Be on your guard at all times as we proceed. Watch out! Ah! What's going on? Is that light coming from the room in the center? The mutation is continuing. Has the abyss made its move already? Jane Smith, I see your incessant meddling continues, and that you have once again joined forces with our Highness's kin. Regrettably, I was not in time to control your exit from the network, and it sent you here of all places. <laughs> this was a catastrophic error. <laughs> I am surprised that you dare to face me. You ran like a coward last time. Our Highness's will must be done. All interferences must be removed, whatever the price to pay. This time, the curse that torments our people must be undone, once and for all. You are the only ones who torment them. There is nothing else left of those hilly churls. Nothing besides the curse itself. Say what you wish. I am going nowhere, Dainsliff. Then you will give your life just to delay the inevitable. How absurd. But since you wish to persist, then so be it! You really think you can use that device beneath the pool to cleanse this curse? Do not underestimate the ways of the abyss! This cannot provide the cleansing effects of the water, not tenfold, but a hundredfold! Then I overestimated you. This plan is even cruder than I thought. Motion to compel! <laughs> you come a little closer. Busted. You're in for a little shock. 
come a little closer. You're in for a little shock. <laughs> Incinerate! Come a little closer. You're in for a little shock. Leave it all to me. Gotcha. Come a little closer. As a dutiful maid would. I must leave no stone unturned. Motion to come. I missed a spot. Busted. He'd come a little closer. Incinerate! Objection! The end is nigh! You're in. Motion to compel! There's no time to celebrate. The Abyss Order's device is activating, but there's still time to destroy it. All right, let's 